everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to share with you what I bought from Sephora during their VIB sale. I placed my orders on um, November 4th and 5th, but they didn't arrive until yesterday, which was November 14th. Um, I had an exam, so I couldn't see the package until I was home, and I was home pretty late. And then my husband was trying to open the package, and I kind of snatched it away from him. I was like, you don't get to do that. I was waiting for 10 days. <laughs> and you know, you know the rush of opening um, your the boxes when you buy something online I was like no you I won't let you do that I have to open it and then he's like fine like he just thought he was trying to get like you know to speed up the process I was like I don't need anyone to speed up the process for me I want to open it myself so yeah anyway I'm sorry if any of you think that's rude but you know that's just how I am I need to um, enjoy the feeling of opening it you know if I'm especially if I can't go to the store and you know buy it but yeah um, I bought some skincare items and I also bought a few items that I um, normally use um, during these sales I try to stock up on things I use and you know usually Sephora items are quite expensive uh, might not be to you but uh, to a lot of people they are expensive to me so I try to wait for a sale and who doesn't like a good sale so yeah if you want to know what I got then please keep on watching so the first item I bought is um, Kat Von D's Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in this holiday special set um, they're mini sizes of course um, they're not full size but I bought one of these last year and um, the shades were obviously different it had a lot of purple um, reds and it, it was a different mix of color but this time it's a lot of dark browns and nudes and I think there's a black in here that I'm super excited about um, so yeah I love the formula of these liquid lipsticks and they're one of my most favorites so this is the perfect way to try out different shades because um, for me I wear a lot of nudes so I never buy um, like for other shades I try to stick to smaller sample sizes rather than the full size because I know that I'll never get to use it up so this is one great way to try them all next item I bought is Sephora favorites um, lashes. I thought it would be nice. I got the lashes to go, lash stash to go. Um, yeah, it was only $33 and um, you know, you get sample sizes of all that um, mascaras and then if you like um, one of them, you can go get the full size. I think they include uh, some sort of a voucher inside where you can just um, get the full size. And this was a really good deal because I think um, one of these mark, mark, one of these mascaras cost about thirty dollars or so, or you know even more. So you can try them all for thirty three, and then you get the whole size, like one full size of the one that you like, or just nothing. So that's another great way. And I think these items um, that I'm showing, a lot of them are like value items. So you know you get to try multiple. Um, uh, colors or um, products of a single brand and these are also pretty good for um, gift ideas so I think I think they're pretty good um, as gifts so yeah I got these and then next item I got is the Peter Thomas Roth uh, meet your mask I wanted to get the one with the tubs at first um, but then I kind of <laughs> realize that you know I'm never gonna use it up and it'll probably expire before I'm done using it because um, for me I like um, using homemade masks but sometimes it's nice to use store-bought you know you, you get to see what the hype is about um, and I thought I'd try it out and then I was like yeah I think this smaller size is pretty good because um, I have the small size of this cucumber one and this tube like I used it a few times and it's still so much left, like there's so much left in it and I didn't think it was just, you know, I didn't have to buy those tubs, but, and, and I think it's sold out now, so this one is not, so if you can, grab it, I mean, even if um, the sale is over, um, this is still a value set, so I would definitely recommend trying out these things. Next item I got is the um, Origins Superstar um, set. This set comes with a lot of a variety of their um, 
popular items. Um, for me, I, I like their um, mask, the Drink Up Intensive Mask. It comes with this tiny bit of that too. Um, but yeah, I thought this would be a great way to try out um, a variety of their other products because I really like that intensive mask and um, because I liked it, I thought why not try out some other items from their line. So this is also another great gift idea. This is um, $45 but it's valued at $98, so $45 USD, $58 Canadian. So. But it's valued at um, 98 USD. So it's a good bang for your buck. And, you know, you should totally, um, you know, if you're thinking of trying new skincare items, this is a great way to try them. I know I sound repetitive, but I most of the stuff I got are like that. Um, the next item I got is the Bosha Subaki Splash Mask. This was on the sale section um, on their website, and then I got the 20% off, so I thought it, I, it had good, quite good re review, so I thought, you know, I should try this. It's kind of weird, like the way you have to apply it, it's kind of strange. Like you have to mix it with warm water, and then you have to splash it on your face. I've never done things like that, so that'll be an interesting thing to try. The next item I have is a backup of the intensive, drink up intensive overnight mask. I have super dry skin um, and I bought this mask on a whim last um, year and for the longest time I didn't use it and like for me I'm very lazy when it came, like comes to skincare stuff. I usually try to stick to um, homemade masks and my tried and true Avino body lotion. That's what I put on my face. I mean, it's not smart, but that's what I've been doing for years, and that's what I do. And sometimes I forget to moisturize, and I have super dry skin, dry, flaky skin. But lately, I've been having a lot of skin issues, um, and so I thought, hmm, don't I have that overnight mask? Why not try it out? And then I started trying it out and I absolutely loved it. I was like, oh my gosh, why didn't I use it for the last year? And um, since then I've been trying to use it every other day because um, that's how dry my skin is. I don't know why I haven't been taking care of it. But yeah, um, so I thought I'd just get a backup because I know I will use the one that I have up. I know that I'll finish that off, so might as well get this. And the next item I got is the Origins High Potency Night uh, Skin Refining Oil. Now this was recommended to me by my friend Saima. Hello Saima if you're watching. Um, thank you I got this <laughs> because of you. Um, she told me about it last year and um, last year was it last year or like during the spring VIB sale we were talking about random stuff and then she's like oh my god you should totally try this out and I thought you know next time there's a sale and Sephora, I'm gonna go get it. And then <laughs> I texted her, I was like, what was the item you told me about? And then she told me it was this item. So thank you, I'm gonna try this out. And the next item I have is the Kat Von D's Tattoo Liner. Um, I heard so many rave reviews about it and I, I've been putting this away because I, I'm not a big fan of um, marker types of eyeliners because when you wear heavy eyeshadows and then if you have super dry skin like I do, they don't apply well. Like they apply very, I don't know, not watery, but like they're not um, dense or how do you say, saturated. Like it looks like a very watery black liner for me. Like all the others I have tried and I've tried a few um, and you know, none of them, I, did, I didn't find them to be the blackest black. And a lot of times when people have good reviews, um, they're quite light in skin tone. So um, I guess like even um, eyeliners that are not the blackest black look pretty black on them. But then when I use them, they don't look so black. So um, I was like, you know what, this is probably going to be like that. And like, so I just didn't want to get it. But then this year I was like, ah, what's the harm? I'll just try it out because, you know, it could be as good as everyone says it is so yeah I got this one and the last item yes this is the last item the last item I have is the rosebud self lip balm 
Um, I got it a couple of years ago and then I really liked it but I lost the <laughs> container and then this year I was like, hey, maybe I should grab one of those. So that's about it. It's not a lot of stuff but um, it's still a lot for me. I know it's mostly skincare and not a lot of makeup. Um, but you know, I've reached a point where I, I don't feel like I need any more makeup because I was kind of tempted to get the Desert Dusk. Was it Desert Dusk by um, Huda Beauty or was it Desert Husk? Oh my gosh, I don't know, I'm going crazy. So yeah, I, I was tempted to get that. But then I thought, you know what, I probably have those colors somewhere and maybe I'm missing a couple of, but I don't know if it's worth to spend so much money just for a couple of shades so I just didn't get it um, I, I find that a lot of makeup gets wasted because I'm constantly buying and then not using it up I mean if you're using it that's fine but um, lately I haven't been maybe because I've been so busy with so many things but yeah so I just thought I should invest a little more on my skin um, I do have a lot of skincare stuff coming up soon in my channel. Um, I don't want to talk more about that, but yeah, um, if you stay tuned, um, hopefully you'll get notified when I upload the video. If not, you can click the bell button and then you will definitely get notified when I upload a new video. I know I didn't upload a weight loss video um, this week because I had an exam and I, I get really bad panic attacks before exams so I was just like you know what I don't want to think about anything else so but soon you're gonna say um, hopefully I'll upload it right after this one um, I'll give you an update on what I'm doing with my weight loss and um, a lot of you were so supportive and it meant a lot to me you have no idea how much it means. I mean, you probably think this girl is talking to the screen, doesn't probably care about us because she can't see us. But you know, like all those nice comments, they meant a lot. Um, and I try to reply to everyone. Um, sometimes I don't get notifications. So please don't think that I'm ignoring anyone because I'm not. Sometimes, you know, Facebook and YouTube does weird stuff and <laughs> it doesn't um, give me a notification. So. Thank you, thank you for being with me and thank you for your support. I hope you guys like this video. If so, please give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next one. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.